I mean, it's always a pleasure yeah, to come back and play Anfield, especially for a good cause. For the LFC Foundation, it's a special day for us, special day for the club, for the city. Uh, so we won again, so the three points in the bag. <laughs> but what a lovely afternoon. And the stadium seems to get bigger every time you play here. Is it probably the biggest crowd you've played in since you've been doing the Legends games? The pitch gets bigger and bigger, you know, year after year. But uh, when you see uh, full house, 60,000 fans, I mean, there's only one club, it's Liverpool. It's been a strange season, hasn't it, with the news of Jürgen leaving and, and the club being in now for three trophies. I mean, what have you made of how we will perform so far this season? The boss came this morning to say hello, you know, and uh, of course it's a, it's a massive year. But the scenario could be fantastic if they are winning the title, you know. And uh, I think he was doing, he's doing really well. They done really great. So finger crossed, they will win the title. It's a big challenge that whoever takes over replacing replacing him has. But the infrastructure is there with the new sporting system, with the new director of football and the new football CEO. Do you have confidence that Liverpool will be okay in the long term? Yes, but it will be diff really difficult to be the next Jurgen Klopp. <laughs> You know what I mean by that? Yeah. <laughs> obviously, the title race has been quite intense as well. Liverpool and Manchester City and Arsenal are all head to head. Um, and obviously, Sunday is going to be a big game next weekend with the Brighton game and, and the game with the Etihad. I mean, do you feel that Liverpool maybe have the momentum behind them because they have the, the early game and then it's all on the Etihad after that? You know the demand from the Premier League? Week by week, so I mean, it's a uh, bit tough. I think it's nine games to go, uh, it's a long way to go. So, I think, uh, of course, on Sunday is a massive game, but now if you are winning all the new games, we'll see. But it's, maybe, uh, it's not an easy one yeah? defensively as well. You, you obviously, it's your special position. What have you made of obviously the youngsters coming in, like Connor Bradley and and I just, love I just love it. I think it's superb to see young boys from the academy. Alex is doing a really great job at the academy as academy director. So it's nice to see young boys, you know, playing in front of the cup and feel great quality as well. So I think the future looks great. Do you think Virgil being on his best level again as captain? Do you think Virgil van Dijk being on his best level again as captain has helped bring them into the fold and make them a bit more at ease? It's always easy to play alongside a player like him. You know, great experience, great leader, a winner. So I'm not worried for the young boys. Did you ever have that experience yourself at Liverpool with Sammy Hippie maybe? Did they sort of help you bring you on a little bit? Yeah, yeah of course. And uh, Sammy was a captain as well, so proper leader. So it was fantastic to play alongside him yeah, for me.